To the best of our knowledge, it was a private helicopter from Linden, New Jersey. Now, whether or not it was owned by a company or an individual, we just don't know at this point. All I can say is uh, all New Yorkers feel for this family, uh, and uh, we wish it had not happened, and our prayers are with the deceased, and our prayers are also that those three people in the hospital uh, recover from their injuries. Everybody was here, you know, within seconds of this occurring. Uh, we happened to be you know, right on the FDR Drive at 23rd Street, and we were able to jump off and uh, we were able to pull the first guy out of the water and uh, get him to safety and uh, assist in the rescue of the second person uh, as more public safety person came on scene. It was, uh, it was two men uh, holding on to um uh, holding on to the um, the chopper, uh, uh, on the, the undergarment of the chopper, screaming that uh, they needed some help. Uh, and uh, we were able to uh, additionally throw uh, uh, some life preservers to them between Wes and I. Wes uh, tied it off uh, with some help of uh, the um, field staff that was on site, the uh, aviation the staff. staff. The heliport staff uh, assisted us also. You kind of, everything just kind of jumps into into play where you, 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 you see the situation and you want to help and that's what we did here and, and, and people's lives uh, were saved because of that and uh, it was a well coordinated effort between all the different agencies that were on site. It's a sad day uh, but I think uh, one of the comforting things was the way the police department, fire department and office of emergency management came together, uh, worked together and did uh, whatever was humanly possible to reduce the loss of life.